Hello guys. So in this session, we are going to learn how to install Tomcat 10 on Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So let's start. So here is my article and so we are going to follow this article. So first of all, as you can see here, here I launch one instance, Ubuntu instance, and we are successfully connected to our terminal, instance terminal. So you can see here, welcome to Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So we are going to download Tomcat on this instance, Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So first of all, I'm going to clear the screen. And now, first of all, we need to update our system package. So how to update? As you know the command, so the command is sudo apt update. Okay, so it's done. So let's clear the screen. Okay, now let's check the next step in our article. Okay, so we are successfully updated our system package. So next is we need to install Java. So let's install using this command sudo apt install open JDK 11. So we are going to install Java version 11. So if you do you want to continue, so yes, I can say yes. So it takes few seconds to install Java 11. So let's wait for a few seconds. Okay, you can see here, it's done. So let's clear the screen. So we are successfully installed Java. So let's check. So first of all, let's clear the screen. So now let's check the Java version. How to check? So as you know the command Java hyphen hyphen version. You check Java version. So you can see here we are successfully installed. Open JDK 11. Okay, now let's clear the screen. Okay, it's done. Now, next step is here, creating a system user. So how to create, so you can say the command, the following command creates a new system user and group with home directory slash opt tomcat that will run the tomcat service. So for that, we need to create user system user so for that we need to run this command so let's run okay it's done now the next step is downloading tomcat so how to download you can see here the tomcat zip file the in this tmp directory using the wget command so let's download tomcat using wget command on this slash tmp directory so we are going to download tomcat version 10, 10. so that's why i'm going to run this command version 10 and after that we are going to run this command using wget we are going to download our tomcat So it's done. So let's clear the screen first. And in slash, uh, uh, so in our TMP directory, we have successfully downloaded our Tomcat. After that, once the Tomcat file is downloaded, we need to extract this file via in this directory. So for that, we need to run this command to extract our Tomcat uh, uh, that we have downloaded. 
let's extract. So it's run. After that, now let's run this command. Okay, it's also done. Now let's clear the screen. Now, the next step is the system user we previously created must have access to the Tomcat installation directory. So now we need to change the directory ownership to user and group Tomcat. So for that, we need to run this command to change the ownership. Okay, it's done. After that, the next step is the shell script inside the Tomcat spin directory must be executed in order to run. So for that, we need to run this command, this chmod command. Information. Okay. Now let's clear the screen. And now the next step is we need to create systemd unit file. So how to create, so you can see here the location the systemd unit file. So we need to open this file. So here we are going to use uh, Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So for that, we need to use this editor sudo nano and the location of our file. So Tomcat service, right? So let's open this file and here we need to, here we need to paste this file, paste this uh, configuration. Here you can see. So let's copy. Okay. So it's done, right? So here I'm going to paste. And here in environment, here you can see here is our Java path, right? Java home path. So if your Java home path is different, then you can set here. Okay, now save the file. How to save? Control plus X, Y for save, and then press enter. So it's done. So we have successfully created Tomcat to you know, system unit file. Now let's run this command to reload the system. So let's run this command. Okay. Done. Now let's enable our Tomcat service. So let's enable. So it's done. Now let's check the status. So as you know how to check sudo systemd, sorry, sudo systemctl status, then Tomcat. So you can see it's active running. That means you have successfully installed Tomcat on Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. Right, okay, it's done. Now, next step, next step is, let's check the next step. Now the next step is, okay, we have successfully check our status. Now here you can see, if you want to stop our your our Tomcat, then you can run this command, sudo systemctl stop uh, Tomcat. Then if you want to start, then you can run this command sudo systemctl start tomcat. And if you want to restart, then you can run this command. And if you want to check the status, then you can run the command sudo systemctl status tomcat. So that the commands to start, stop, restart and status command. Next is configuring firewall. So you need to open port 8080. So use the following command to open the port. So let's run this command to open port 8080. So you can see rules updated. Okay, now it's done. Now the next step is create Tomcat user. So how to create, we need to open tomcat user.xml file to create a new user. So how to open, so here we are going to use Ubuntu 22.04 LTS, so that's why the editor is nano. So let's open the tomcat 
user.xml file. And here we need to create new user. And here, scroll down. And here we need to create new user. So how to create? So you can see here, I'm going to use this code. And I'm going to paste here. So here you can see, here my username is admin and my password is password so remember this username and password admin and password okay now save the file and exit okay now the next step is enable remote tomcat access so how to enable so we need to comment the ip address section so here we need to open this context.xml file and the location is here. So let's open and here we need to comment the IP section. So let's check where is the IP section. Here. Value from here. So how to comment? So you can see here. Okay, so you can see here. The color is yellow, that means it's commented. Okay, now save the file and exit. Okay, same for this. You can see a similar for this file also. So let's do it. So, commented value section. Sorry, I mean, IP section. Okay, now save the file and exit. Okay, it's done. Okay, so once it's done, restart the Tomcat service. So as you know, when we changes any configuration file or any file, we need to restart our service. So let's restore Tomcat. Okay, now let's check the status once. Okay. All okay, right? It's running. Okay. Now, now it's done. Now let's test Tomcat service. So how to test? You can see here once open, open your browser and type your domain IP and the port is 8080. Then we reach this page, right? That means you have successfully installed Tomcat. So let's check. So let's Check our instance IP address. Okay. So let's check our instance IP. So copy our instance IP and then the port number is 8080. Okay, so let's open a browser. And paste the IP colon 8080. So you can see here our Tomcat, the version is 10 and you can see the page. If you are seeing this, you have successfully installed Tomcat. Congratulations, you can see the note here. If you are seeing this, you have successfully installed Tomcat. So congratulations. Okay. So as you remember uh, that our uh, username and password. So where we are going to use. So here you can see the server status, manage app, host manager. So I'm going to click on manager app. So if I click on this, you can see it will ask me username and password. So my username is admin and password is password, right? Sign in. Never. 
So you can see your Tomcat Web Application Manager and you can see the details. Okay. So we have successfully installed Tomcat. Okay, so if I go to the server status, then you can see the details, server status, list applications and JVM version and so on. You can say 22.04 LTS, okay. So you can see the details of your Tomcat server status. Okay. So we have successfully installed Tomcat on Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So thank you for watching.